Hello friends, welcome to the channel DevOps Vijay. Today we will be learning about how to download Eclipse IDE, install it in your Windows box and we will try to switch the Maven version. Eclipse download is easy but the thing is when you download the normal uh, MSI or the executable file it will throw some error. So you have to download the zip file and then do the installation. And when you download the Eclipse ID, it comes with the embedded Maven. So you can directly create a Maven project through Eclipse ID. But the thing is, if you do not want to use that particular Maven version, how do you change the Maven version in Eclipse ID and create a new sample project in Eclipse ID for Maven? Okay, let's go ahead. Go to the internet. If you type Eclipse IDE download, you will get the first link. Okay, when you click on this, you will be able to see this is the latest download. When you click on this, it will download exe file. Okay, if you click on this exe file, it will throw some proxy error. Uh, it's not necessary that everybody will get the proxy error, but I was getting the proxy error so installation was not working you can see after taking a couple of minutes it has uh, the catalog could not be loaded please sure that you have network access and if needed configured proxy so you have to configure proxy and all those things so I don't want to go in this situation so I have closed it I, I am not using a normal download method again go to the internet now instead of Eclipse IDE download type zip also okay you will get one package location for eclipse only click on the first link okay if you see you will get various options like you want to download eclipse id for java developer for java and web developer c developer eclipse community php rack modeling tool scientific so many eclipse software is coming okay you can download the second version or the first one Eclipse ID for Java developers I would suggest second one is the best Java and web developers you just click on the Windows part if you click on this you will be able to download the zip file you can see zip is there you click on this and zip will get downloaded the zip file I have downloaded it and extracted it once you extract you will get the Eclipse folder okay you will see Eclipse.exe again when you click on this and click on run it will not do the installation okay but you will be able to use the IDE on your windows without installing the Eclipse IDE. You can see I have opened the Eclipse IDE just like that without installation. So this is the way you can use the Eclipse without installing the Eclipse actually. Okay. So this was the first part. Let's go to the next part. How to create a sample Maven project uh, using the Eclipse ID by default Eclipse comes with the Maven embedded versions okay if you click on file if you click on new you will see various options are there I want to go for creation of a Maven project click on Maven project okay you can see create a simple project skip archetype selection if you might have noticed in previous videos in Maven I have showed you how to create a uh, Maven project in CLI using the quick start and the web app project uh, even the Eclipse IDE will use the same concept but here it's all the GUI you do not have to fire those commands in CLI so click on next if you do if you want to keep the default location as it is let it be if you want to change the location to somewhere else you can change it okay uh, let me give the location C demo some new okay so I have selected this folder click next you can see you can see all the archetypes options are coming quick start web app and so many others so I will go with the quick start which will create a jar file go to the next now here you have to give the group ID and the artifact ID artifact ID is the name of your project so you can uh, give some demo maven project if you might have noticed I am giving D capital M capital P capital this is called camel case okay 
only first letter will be capital so click on finish if you see now it is scanning the project it will download all the dependencies and it will create a sample project in Eclipse IDE using the embedded Maven version okay we'll check the what is the embedded Maven version also now it is asking to press Y to come here click on Y click enter build is successful let's go to our Windows box okay see new and you can see demo Maven project has been created if you see because of IDE two new files has come class path and project if you do not want to monitor or track this in git then you can put the git ignore file else leave it as it is okay you can see all the project file and the pom.xml has been created and this is our uh, maven but the thing is i do not want to use the embedded maven version i want to use my project specific maven version for that you have to install maven in your local machine after installing the maven go to window go to the down click on preference if you see here every all the options are there go to maven expand this go to installations okay if you see by default embedded will be if you see by default embedded will be enabled okay so for adding your maven you have to click on add you have to go to the directory and you have to give your maven location So if you can see, I have given the Maven uh, location uh, where the Maven is installed and it has come here. You can see Maven has come here. So next time you select this, click on apply, apply and close. Now if you run this project or if you create any new project like this project is created, right? Right click on this run as maven build clean maven install click on maven install now it is going to build that project using our maven 3.9 latest which was present uh, which was the requirement of my project you can see the build is successful so this is how you change the Maven version in Eclipse IDE and create a new project, Maven project in Eclipse using Eclipse IDE itself. Thank you for watching this video.